Hey everybody and welcome to TechZool. I'm your host Amanda Kulong and I'm here with another host actually, Ken Rakowski. How are you? I'm good. It's great to be on your show, I guess, right? I know, right? Here on TechZool and I've been on your show too, so there we go. Well, Ken, we're, we're here talking because you are the recipient of the Digital Family Outstanding Achievement Honor that is going to be bestowed upon you this Wednesday. How do you feel to join the ranks of Nolan Bushnell and William Quigley and Eric Pullier, Jim Jonasson, Scott Painter? Am I missing anyone? <laughs> uh, Jake Weinbaum. There you go. I mean, a lot, I guess a whole bunch of great people. I have no idea why I'm even on this list because they are amazing people. Um, I'm honored. I'm honored, flattered, and humbled. Well, I, I think that you're a, a perfect addition to the list. I mean, you have done a lot in the SoCal tech scene. I mean, there was this organization you started a while ago called Metal that's still running today, and you have numerous events, some which are co-ed as well. Um, how, do you think that that, that Metal alone, without even going into these other details, has really helped to, I guess, build the fabric of the community, so to speak? I think if anything you do that helps a community and it's consistent and predictable, mm -hmm. it's, it'll grow, right? But it's got to right. be consistent and predictable. And we've done that. It's, it's a hard thing to do, as you know, doing events. Yeah. Because you have no idea how many people are going to show up. You don't know if it's going to be good. You don't know what's, what the outcome is going to be. But you always have to roll the dice every event and the show's got to go on. And Absolutely. We've yeah, been doing it for almost, uh, what, almost 10 years yeah. And, um, it, it's not just metal. It's all the events. We put on a lot mm -hmm. of events in, in Los Angeles, and I believe L.A. is the epicenter of opportunity. I, I love mm -hmm. Los Angeles. Right. And I, I do, too. I mean, a lot of us came here thinking we were going elsewhere, and we've just stayed. And one, one question I always ask all these recipients is, given that you have been around for the last decade or so here, how is this second wave, so to speak, compared to the first wave? Now we have this thing called Silicon Beach. Um, before, Jason well, what, Calacanis had said Digital Coast, you know. So what do you think about that? What, what, are, what are your thoughts? Well, I do like Creative Coast more, by the way. Oh, okay. okay. Well, because I, I think it's not technology that's driving all this. Ah. Uh, and as we go Silicon Beach or Digital Coast, I, I think we throw back to the whole technology front, and that's up north. Yep. You know, we, we want San Francisco and the Valley up there to own that and maintain sure. that. Here it's all around media, entertainment, and technology. I mean, it's, it's entertainment really drives us. Content cr drives this. Mm -hmm. And what's different here is I think we, at least on this round, it's about revenue. Okay. It's about let's make money. Let's uh, not just be a company that takes a lot of venture capital and mm -hmm. tries to get as many users as possible, not knowing that there's a financial other side now it's about money sure. I think it's I think the business people here are real business people and before the first run as you would say it's it's dreamers and there's nothing wrong with dreamers but it's real business people that are making sure. things happen and this round run uh, there's so much more on the the women community women are, are are much more active we're seeing some names really pop up that are driving it that's exciting we didn't have that the other run mm -hmm. uh, and it's a young community, you know. It they're, is. It, it's awesome, isn't it? It is. It's and they're respected. I, I personally feel that when you come to the West Coast, uh, com coming from New England myself, you get much more respect as a younger individual and as a woman out here. Absolutely, and that's great. And last thing is, mm -hmm. this run is we do have incubators and accelerators. Mm -hmm. We have from Start Engine, Mucker Labs uh, to Science. These are something that we didn't have before, and that's what really is fueling all these great ideas, is there's good environments to come up with an idea, to make it happen, make it grow, and then find you know, your customers or someone to possibly buy you. Sure, sure. And another great piece that you and I can always go back and forth on here are all of these different startups that we get to meet. So the other component of you, you've got metal and there, you've had many, many speaking engagements, but recently, fairly recently, you started a radio show called Business Rockstars. And that's now being syndicated where now? Nationally? Yeah, we'll be national. Uh, not just... Uh, audio, but also video. Sure. Uh, we're working on a, a pilot for a TV show, mm -hmm. but that allows me to meet two to three brand new companies every single day. Yeah. And you know what's great is we never have a problem finding somebody new. That's so, pretty telling about Southern California, then, huh? <laughs> you know, after almost two years doing this, 
we've met thousands of new companies and it's so exciting. And, and, and the other thing is they don't go out of business. Yeah. You know, either they pivot into something new or they continue to grow. And I love seeing this. I love it. God, it's great. Yeah. Yeah. And so thank you. You know, thank you for joining the ranks of the media folk that are out there touting what's happening in Southern California. It's a good place. I, I think it is too. So we are returning, returning to the Skirball Cultural Center, which was the very first home of Digital Family Reunion, and that is this Wednesday from six to ten. So I'm assuming we will be seeing you there, Ken. I'm going to be there for okay. sure. Okay, and we're also going to be honoring fifty of the up and coming companies in Southern California, not just Los Angeles, but SoCal as a whole. And that is in partnership with um, SoCal Tech. So that's the first time that we're going to be seeing all of those recipients here at you know the uh, Digital Family Reunion event. So, what do you think of that list, by the way, Ken? Have you had a chance to look through it? Oh, I looked at the list. Uh, probably ninety percent of them been on the show. I was going to say. It, but what I love about it is it's the diversity. It's not just tech. It's fashion. Mm -hmm. A lot of fashion around pets, mm -hmm. around healthcare. It's such a diverse list. Yeah. Where if you go somewhere else in the country, if you go to San Francisco or if you go to Austin or New York, they're very niched in their, those areas. Mm -hmm. We're all over the place, and that's what's really exciting. So what you're saying then is that Southern California entrepreneurship is quite vast, and it's not just about tech. Absolutely. That's why we got to call it the Creative Coast. All right. Creative Coast with Ken Rakowski. I think that's another show in, in your lineup. <laughs> All right. On that. Well, thank you so much for joining us here, Ken, and we cannot wait to see you on Wednesday. Thank you very much. I'm, again, I'm honored for the award. And you should be. I mean, you join a great, great list, a wonderful lineup, and congratulations. So we will see you soon. Thank you very much. Thanks. Bye-bye.